reporter Riley Phillips also joining us live from Dayton with team coverage on the damage that was left behind today. Riley. Brooke, the wind is still fierce out here today, but the storms overnight were even stronger, knocking down trees and damaging some property. And at one point, 18,000 people were without power in the Miami Valley. Lucas Glandon was working at another home when he saw this tree down in Oakwood. He was actually just working for the neighbor, doing some stump grinding landscaping today and talking about getting the tree in the back there removed for him to make it safer for the property. And this just so happened to be sitting here when I pulled up. It fell during Wednesday night storm as strong winds blew across the Miami Valley, knocking down limbs and leaving thousands of people in the dark. Glandon owns l, &L Lands, a tree service company in the Dayton area. He knows how common this type of damage can be after a storm. Typically during a storm, we get three or four calls after the wind blows and we have to take trees off of houses. And even a perfectly healthy tree can be taken down by a storm. Because of this, Glandon stresses the importance of routine maintenance on your trees. He says you never know what might happen in a storm. Just balancing the trees, opening the wind channel, thinning them out. You know, always, always call tree services to come out and give a free estimate. And local tree service companies will be working throughout the next few days to clear trees from people's homes and prepare for the next storm. Live in Dayton, Riley Phillips, 5 on 2.